yeah good day friends this is joshua the designer and you're welcome again to my channel this is where we have amazing content on structural designs and this is a safe place for you to get better as touching structural engineering on civil engineering at large right so and today i have come with something interesting and also amazing right so i want you to pay attention today as i show you how you can import or export your drawing rather how you can export your drawing um, using product details right so after you might have uh, modeled your drawing you have done the analysis you have designed and you are done on product structure i want to show you how you can actually go on from product structure down to your product details and get your drawing set for presentation right so i'll be dealing with product details in this video right so if you are new to my channel you may use the like button and subscribe to this channel this is a way to encourage us to always give you amazing content and you can also share with your friends that should get better in structural engineering um thank you so let's just get on to business in a little while you'll catch this and we'll be done yes so we'll have our plan and this is the structure so this structure i want to be sure um if my analysis is up to date so i'll just do a cross check then we can move on so my bidding analysis is up to date um and uh, and that's and that's fine okay so let me check for all my uh, members whether the designs also they are up to date of course they are okay uh, let me check for the sorry i do not have written for the story beams yes very correct so now i'm done with the modeling i'm done with the design i'm done with all that i need to do here on product structure right now so what i'm left to do is to export the drawings from product structure down to whatever it is i want to make the editing and the presentation okay so now i'm going to use the product details right so because you know that product product package um, is with the product structure the product details and the product still right so putting your drawings up to product detail is a deal in this video yes so right now this is a product 2021 software right and i must tell you that it has different interface with other versions of product structure so product 2021 can allow you um transport yourself from product structure directly to product details right okay so on this panel drawings and reports you'll find product details form plans column applications column elevations story beams elevations rib beam elevations foundation beams pad base and pie cap and product steel and all other things right so but here i want to show you about product details so let's go on so once you click product details ask you if you want to save of course you save yeah so you wait till it transports you onto the hand okay so do well to like our video and subscribe to our channel do not forget to do that now we are up to business okay so we are waiting for the product details to load yeah so i want to use um, this opportunity to invite you all to our free structural design class for the year 2022 and it's going to commence in few weeks we would release link you can use the link in my bio use the link in the description of this video um, to get your application for the free structural design class 2022 and in this free structural design class we'll be taking you how to become better with structural designs right from producing a general arrangement drawings right to create major manual analysis of your building component how to import um, all these drawings into your uh, into your softwares and how to create a final presentation drawings and all that you have as personal questions and interest on in structural engineering we can get them solved in those classes do well to hang around because the link to that class will drop this week in one of my video and uh, i expect that you will jump on it okay now we are now on product details you see that it took me there itself right so on this you have the form plans 
which are the layouts of all that you you've done right we have the column application plans showing your column in in the plan form right with the reinforcement in the showing in the plan right in the sections yeah so we have the column elevation drawings so this is the elevation of a column that you've designed using product structure and you have your beams also this is going to show all the beams that you have on every story right if you have a pie cap if you have pie caps rather it will show for you pie cap details right so to start with you can either auto generate your details right all your details you can bring them out automatically right and you can create new drawings to start with right so um, let's create new drawing so i want to create a new drawing now creating a new drawing means that you are taking this as a new project in your proto details right so you want to create um, details for a new project for this project right so i want to create the form plans i want to bring out the form plans so i'll draw right click then you click draw so you have a pop-up box here and this is telling you many things that you need to pay attention to which first of all is that is that telling you to select your your reinforcement bars whether you would like that it shows in the hex top bars the hex bottom bars the y bottom bars if you would like it to show so specifically this is telling you that if you are creating your plans your reinforcement details is going to come out with it right so if you do not want your reinforcement details to come out with your form plans with your layout so you may choose to um, deselect all of these right okay so that is why it is like that okay so then you might insert quantity table right so it's going to come like a, a schedule yes giving you the quantity of reinforcement and the weight of reinforcement and all of that so um the model info also then you can also insert to sheet if you like that right and if you do not want you may not insert to sheet right okay so then you press you click draw clicking draw this pop-up as you go right so then you click on any portion of your environment then we wait for what's coming up so this is showing to us the foundation layout so this is why you're seeing my pie cap details all around you're seeing my pie cap and the dimension and all of that so did you see how how nice it came out okay so and this already i've grouped all my columns right and it has shown it as typical columns yes and that's why we have a long number of them this way okay so the next one i can create for my story one then let's draw that since i've shown you what about the options here yeah. right so we can draw that so clicking this one also you see it came out with a form plan now this is the form plan right okay so that's how it comes out so you can do the same from all of this let me just show you the column application application plans right so column application plan is going to show us the column in as a plan then you can click draw so you can click draw so using this one clicking anywhere on this environment you have your plan now let me show you something about the plan the plan is going to show you the reinforcement the number of reinforcement and the links in it and how the links is to be done right so you have it this way right so let's try one more story before we go to the elevations okay so so the same so you have every column represented and with the number of reinforcement in each of them 
so let's check for the column elevation and we can pick that out simple and direct okay so with this i want to okay so that means my story one doesn't have any column that's why it's empty okay because it's a pile foundation and my story one automatically will be the ground floor so you click draw so uh, you may also select the ones that you want to draw you may select the ones that you want to draw right so let's see what happens here so i think i selected uh, an environment so the thing overlapped my drawing so i wouldn't want it this way so i can actually undo and do it the proper way okay okay so we have this now so this is my columns so these are my columns rather okay very simple and now let me go to my beams you know this is these steps they are unique to whatever project that you're doing you might not have as much details as these for your project as I have here so I'll just press draw and then then I select and away on my environment now because I selected one let us do another one I selected the previous one I selected a single beam so this time let me export and let me draw every one of my beams on that story so you see how it comes out a lot of the beams will be here right now so wow so that's a lot yes again a quick reminder our free structural design class will commence in few weeks and we expect that we'll drop a link this week this week right so you would want to stick to heavy of our videos to watch which of them would hold on will come around with the links so that you can apply for the free structural design classes with this and the goal of this design classes is to make you come from zero knowledge and zero ability with structural design and equip you to get in better and to make you get started in structural engineering okay so you have it this way look at your beams came out all well came out all well yes came out all well right so the pie cap details so i can draw this and place it here so that's one second and third so this is it now i would assume that i am done placing my drawings here right so i want to pick the drawings here down to autocad where i can now begin to draft and make some editing to please my standard right but to please what i want right so i would like that you catch us on the next video and i'll be showing you how to pick your drawings from here down to autocad where you can make major and your final editings and your presentation to suit your taste right thank you very much and joshua the designer do well to like this video and subscribe to this channel and go on to the comment section drop your comments your opinions and everything that you need to know i'll be there to attend to you see you in the next video bye